We're back. We're back. And better than ever. And better than ever. <laughs> I just stopped, I just tripped over that. Oh man. It's nice. <laughs> it is nice. Wow. Is it a Broyhill? This looks like a Brasilica. I don't know. Usually one of the drawers. Yeah, it didn't have them, but maybe in the back. Sometimes they have them in the back. Yeah, it's $50. Yeah, we need some work. It's beautiful, though. Does it say anything on the back? No. Luckily for us, we found one on the curb. I was so afraid you were going to show me like a hutch or something. <laughs> you got it? Yeah. Love it. Isn't it? It's so nice, yeah. Definitely like ours more though. I agree, I do like ours more too. Stop. The shelves are stocked for sure. Um, we have Christmas here. Most of it is looking newer though. We are really after those mid-century pieces. <laughs> what? <laughs> um, look at all the wrapping paper they have out. Huh. It is a little chair. It's a cute little chair. chair. Tablecloth. Halloween. That's fun. There are a lot of cats here today, again. That's like a carnival prize, right? For like the 80s? So. It's a birthday. Happy birthday, Mickey. It's my sort of fun, yeah. yeah. Huh. This is sort of fun, Janine. Made in USA, oh, 68 yeah. Fisher Price. Yeah, it's for the little um, toys. Little guys? Yeah. It's only $2. I wonder, it's probably part of a play set, it. right? They cut a hole in it. Yeah. Part of a play set at one point? Yeah. That's cool. That's sort of fun. Spyro Tot? Spyro Tot. This is a little newer. Like a Kenner. What is this size here? 84. 84. Did you have one of those? Spyro Tot? Yeah. I had, yeah, I had like the knockoff ones. Oh. Uh, I, I think I had one at some point. Monster High Dolls, six dollars. Looks like somebody definitely left their cat collection here. China. Hmm. They're cute, but none of them stick out to me as being older. They're a bit newer. But look guys, on this shelf, a really nice planter. I'll peel up that sticker and see. It looks like a Napco to me. It's really nice. In pretty good condition. And I think it's 50% off. Yep, here are colors orange, blue, and green. So that makes him only $3, which I think is a great score. Look how cute. I also just spotted these two. They're both uh, six dollars with 25% off. This one I thought was really cute and different. This like little baby on a chair. It is pretty dirty, but it is marked Japan. I've seen one with like cats on here before, but never like a little baby like that. It's really cute. And this cat is also made in Japan, but it is broken right there on the bow. So I'll probably leave this one behind, but might pick up this guy. She's so cute. I spotted this. She's sort of cute, isn't she? She is. She's like, I had a full meal. Yeah, she's like chilling. <laughs> What'd you find? Funny Farm Egg Heads Easter Egg Decorating Kit. Oh, how cute. Isn't that adorable? Wow, I can't believe like they put it on the shelf. <laughs> it's like gross inside, but look at these cups. The cups are cute, yeah. That's really cute. It's 99 yeah. cents. This is really cute, though. The packaging. Yeah, it's, all, it's 99 cents. Orange is 25% off. 75 cents. How cute. 
That's probably from like the 70s or the early 80s. How cute. There might be a year. Uh, 71. 90, wow, older than I thought. Me too. 1971. Oh, yeah, that's cool. How's it going? Oh, um, good. I found this little Scotty, which oh, reminded me of the cute. reindeer you sold. Yeah. The Joseph. And looks like somebody had peeled up the sticker. And it was definitely a Joseph. Uh, you could see right there. Oh, it's on the back through it. Yeah. Yeah. It's too bad. It does have a little chip on the ear, though. Oh, it's cute. It is cute. Hmm. Did you find anything? Bugs. Little bugs. Um, 99 cents. Good prices. Yeah, he's um, made in Korea. Old mm -hmm. Warner Brothers. I don't think it's worth anything, but I thought it was cool. Mm. Um, blinds to go, cat. What? Look. <laughs> so weird. Found some cute vintage Easter tablecloths. This one's really cute with the bunnies on the bottom. I don't know how much it is. The tablecloths tend to be like $7 or so. And then I saw this one too with the little bears along the bottom. Oh, this is more like a baby nursery one. Yeah, this one's more like a nursery one, but I thought this Easter one was really cute. If it was a few bucks, I'd pick it up, but I'll double check the price, but I think it's going to be a bit more than that. How cute. I also just spotted this really cute tablecloth. Very like 70s vibe, but it looks so brand new. I wasn't really sure if it was that old, um, but then I found this tag and it says the lily. So I think it's a little bit older. I don't know if it's true 70s, but it's really cute. I think it's a circle and it is $5. So I might pick this up too. It's really cute. Okay guys, alert. I checked the Christmas like three times and I did not see this guy until just now. Little snowman bell for only $2. And I thought, okay, he might be newer, made in China. He is not, he's made in Japan. So this is probably from the 60s, maybe 70s. How adorable, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, it's Noah's Ark. You like that? That's so funny. Little Noah's Ark t-shirt with the parrot on the collar. It's only $4, it's 50% off. That's, that's uh. That's a look. Made in Hong Kong. Made in Hong Kong, it's pretty cool. I did not see that, it's wow. Cute. Let me hold it it's up. really cute. Look at it, because it didn't have How adorable. That is so fun. It's, it's only $7 and it's just a sheet. There's a stain right here. Right, I think I saw a stain on, on Goofy here too. Something right here. Oh, that's minimal. There's some stuff going little on, things. a little bit. Yeah. That's cute though. That's actually a pretty good price considering it's older. But I will say my uh, Disney sheet set is still up on eBay, but I'm not. That's probably because I have it listed for too much money. But look, oh, oh, sorry, jeez, I thought Walt Disney Productions. Yeah, that's cute. I don't know. I don't know how to look it up. I also found a sheet set, and it, I don't know why it intrigued me. It looked a little bit older to me. Um, I took out one of the pillowcases, and it is single stitched. Oh, it's, it's a like cat. a little cat bedding set. Um, and I don't know, it just looked older to me. And I was searching and searching for a tag. It has two pillow sheets. It has a flat and a fitted for $7. Isn't that cute? That's different. Um, it's the only thing I could find. 70... 1979. J.P. Oh, wow. Stevens. And they did a lot of different bedding, but I couldn't find this one in particular. But I thought it was really cool. That is cool. It's just that it's not a twin. It's a full. It might be a mm -hmm. twin. But it's only $7 and it's a full set. If mm -hmm. you can't use the fitted, you could at least use the flat and the pillowcases, I was thinking. Mm -hmm. I don't know. So I was thinking of getting it. Maybe, maybe not. A little bit of a gamble. Mm. That's, That's cool, cool though. It's 25% off. 25% off. So it'd be $6. It's interesting. Maybe. This is fun. I'm spotting from the other side. Um, 19, what does that say? 1993 lamb chop sheets 
so cute. They're in good condition too. That is so fun. I'm looking at you because you just come walking towards me with how many bags? Three. Three bags of what? Well, two. One you don't what? need. What? There's two of these guys in here. Where'd you find these? Toy Where section? Gotta look at the toys. They're just unbelievable. Aren't they cute? Those are cute. Those used to go on top of cakes, usually, from the 70s. Very nice. What else? <gasps> Who in the world do you think you are? Lenticular eyes. I can't believe you found that. Made in Hong it's Kong. It's got some gunk in there. Yeah. So you want to explain what this is, Janine? That's this crazy. This is an old candy container. Look, it had jelly eggs in it. It's from Palisades, New Jersey. Made in Hong Kong. Lenticular eyes. This is like from the 70s. It's an Easter candy container. And it's pretty collectible. Yeah. Wow. And I passed this bag like three times. And I didn't see it until now. Wow. I bet we can clean her out. Yep, we'll have to give her a deep soak. Oh my gosh, she's so cute with those little lenticular blinking eyes. Congratulations. Thank you. And their third bag? Oh, that's nothing. Are you sure it's nothing? It's nothing. Don't need to look what's at it. What's in there? Nothing. What, what's that really cute looking plush? Nothing. What is that? It's a little dragon. Oh, it's so cute. A little it's nose. It's got a really long tongue. That's silly. I found this really amazing, I think it's 1970s uh, tablecloth. It Look at that pattern. I love that pattern. It is so fun for summer. I picked it up for $5 and this is on my eBay right now. It's an oblong shape. I'm not gonna be able to capture it all on camera, but it is oblong, it is 83 inches long, and I just think this would look so pretty on someone's dining room table during the summer and spring. I definitely agree. I love the butterflies. Yeah. So pretty. Or you could even repurpose it if you want. It's in great mm -hmm. condition. I also picked up this cat planter. It has a very napco look to it. The paint job is just really great. I have this also listed on my eBay. There's no napco mark on it, but I was able to identify it as a napco. It's really cute. Has a great paint job. There's a little, little tiny chip. chip right there. And also along the feet. But I did clean her up and she looks awfully cute. I did decide to get the little baby on a chair. <laughs> she was just too cute. Look at her. What a transformation. You cleaned her up. Yes, I did clean her up. She's just shiny and bright now. She looks so much better. She's also on my eBay if you guys are interested. She's Mark Japan. And she's just that like classic uh, mid-century made in Japan ceramic. So she's probably from like the 60s and she's really cute. She'd be really cute for like... Um, a granddaughter or a nursery room. Mm. Um, she just has the cutest little face. I can't believe you found this, Janine. I know, it's so cool. So this is a 1970s candy container, which does have the candy in it. Sort of gross. I think what we should do is boil some water and like open this up and let it sit and try to get this stuff out. We're definitely going to try to do that. Um, otherwise, we could just keep our head maybe. But this is a candy container and it actually says made in Hong Kong. Yeah. I don't know if you can see on camera. And those lenticular eyes. That's what's so cool about her is that she has these lenticular eyes. This is probably somewhat hard to find. Probably sought after. She'd probably sell for like $15 to $20. Wow. She's really cool. And again, got to check those uh, toy bags. You never yeah. know what's hiding in them. And go down a few times because I missed her. Mm, that's true. You also found this egg decorating kit. Couldn't believe it was from 1971. I know. I thought it was a little bit newer, but no. It was only 75 cents. It's this really cute little barn. And inside, what you guys saw, it still has like some of the things in it. Let's take a look at these cups in here. So I was looking. The cups go upside down, and they hold an, they're supposed to like hold an egg on top. Oh, something. okay. So like the As Easter like bunny little, yeah. with the egg on top. Cute. What's this one? A bird. And a cow. <laughs> Cute. And these are really small. And then there are some bigger cups. And here they are. It's funny. I'm reading the inside. It says Happy Easter from the funny barn. Farm. From the funny farm? It's a little hard to, to focus. So it's not focusing. It says Happy Easter from the funny farm eggheads. Um, and I guess these are also similar. They have like different uh, designs on them. Mm -hmm. Maybe you made like a whole farm with the different eggs and the... It's probably yeah. like a play set for eggs, which mm -hmm. is sort of fun. 
feel like they don't make stuff like this anymore, you know? This would be so fun as a kid to make, make a little barn with like these cups and your Easter eggs that you dyed. Yeah, it has the original instructions and you can actually see um, they show like illustrations of the eggs on top of the cups. It's so cute. So that's definitely what you did with these. This is so fun. I wonder uh, if any of you guys had this as a kid. Let us know, but this is so fun and cute. You're going to keep it, Janine? I think so. It's really fun. Thank you guys so much for joining us in another thrifting trip. We had a lot of fun. We hope you did too. If you're enjoying our videos, we'd really appreciate it if you hit that subscribe button, especially if you made it this far. That must mean you enjoy our videos. Otherwise, make sure to give this video a like. And uh, yeah, here's to more thrifting in the upcoming weeks as it gets warmer. Thanks for joining us, guys. See you next time. Bye. Bye.